My name is Jim Tatum. I live at 914 Southwest Riverland Court, Fort White, Florida. I'm not a resident of this county, but I am a riparian landowner on the Santa Fe River <coughs> downstream of this proposed mine, and any damage this company does to the river may affect my property. Mines are prone to accidents which damage the environment even when the rules are followed. The Camars have proven to violate the limits of their permit, which shows that they do not care for the environment, but only about making money. They are currently operating under consent order because of repeated violations. When the ore process at the commercial facility, the wastewater has the potential to spill into drainage systems that include the Santa Fe River. This has occurred already and does not have to be an accident to happen. During times of, a, of an approaching hurricane or heavy rainstorms, commercial routinely dumps more than their allotted amount of water from retention ponds in order to avoid a breach. This process water flows by my house ends up in the Gulf of Mexico via the Santa Fe River and the Suwannee River. In addition, Comores is under a consent order from the Florida Department of Environmental Protection for several violations. <coughs> Comores also allows the Alabama-based Twin Pines Minerals to mine in their area, which began operation in Bradford County without a permit. They also dumped waste fill into wetlands <coughs> illegally. These and other violations show them as well to be known, known non-compliers of laws and regulations who do not care for the environment and will likely damage the wetlands which are critical to replenishment of the aquifer. Our Florida rivers, including Santa Fe, are already impaired and overloaded with contaminants. We do not need nor do we want more, uh, more of those which origin, whose origin is a for-profit corporation. In addition to my concern about the Santa Fe River, I have an interest in the risk to the Florida aquifer since it flows southward to the area in which I live. Science proves that the aquifer is declining both in quantity and quality. A for-profit company does not have the right to put this natural resource at risk just to make money. The jobs that this mining operation will bring to the county must be weighed against the damage to the environment. We can always get money from various sources, but once our wells start pumping salt water, we will have no more clean water and we may not be able to buy any more. Comores is not a good neighbor. Please deny this permit. Thank you.